Most big tech efforts to secure the boot process give the vendor control over what software you're allowed to boot on your laptop, with keys they control. With PeerBoot Restricted Boot, you can lock down your boot firmware to only boot trusted signed executables on both your local disk and USB, all controlled with your own keys. Restricted Boot is disabled by default to give you maximum flexibility over what OSs you can boot, but once it's enabled, an attacker can't disable it without triggering a tamper warning. To enable it, ensure you're running at least version 23 of PeerBoot. If you need to upgrade, follow along with this video. With the latest PeerBoot installed, head to Options, Change Configuration Settings, Enable Restricted Boot. Next, select Save Changes to the running BIOS. After rebooting, you can still boot your system as normal, but you'll no longer be allowed to ignore tamper warnings by booting into failsafe mode. This also disables options like the recovery shell. In this mode, your computer will outright refuse to boot when your boot files aren't signed with your paired Librem key. During normal use, when you update your OS while restricted boot is enabled, it will behave much like you expect. If your kernel changes, you'll be prompted to re-sign your files in slash boot using your Librem key, and once you do, you'll be able to boot into your OS as normal. In this mode, you can also boot pre-approved signed distros with a USB. Instead of imaging directly to a USB, copy the ISO and corresponding ASC GPG signature file the vendor provides. This will allow you to boot from ISOs on a USB disk as long as the signature matches one of the trusted public keys in the PureBoot ISO key ring. By default, we include public keys for Arch Linux, Cubes, Tails, and PureOS. Later on, we'd like to add a feature that lets you modify the approved keys from within the GUI itself, but that feature didn't make it into this first release. To disable restricted boot, go back to Options, Change Configuration Settings, and select Disable Restricted Boot. To prevent someone from disabling this without detection, once you select this option, your TPM will be reset. This will notify the proper user of tampering once they try to boot their computer again. PeerBoot provides flexible security measures with defaults that balance security and ease of use. Restricted Boot allows you to tighten down the security even further while still having full control over your own system. Get your Librem 14 laptop with PeerBoot at puri.sm.